Hey guys, Jack the Muss here. I'm just doing a, uh, a little review on my bike. I've just stopped off on the way home from work. Today I've actually got over 30,000 kilometers put up on the X. So I thought, what a nice spot to do a review. So the things I've learned after 30,000 kilometers about the X, there's a couple of little negatives and a couple of positives. If you've seen my last review, you know what I think about the bike. I love the bike itself. It's agile. I can throw it around. Throw it around so much, I've actually dropped it as well. Um, didn't do much damage. Let's have a look at that now. My bit is here. On the back here, you see this here. That's actually come off. It's not a problem. Still works. There's no problem there. Um, I did damage just here. Uh, just on the sissy bar at the back. It did bend this down here, which is not another problem at all. Did do damage on the side here. You can only just sort of see it. I've spray painted it a little bit. Doesn't look too bad. The X sticker itself got a little bit banged up and also to around the knobby, which I've just done. And yeah, which isn't a problem at all. I haven't had any issues with it at all. No problem, I just bent the gear lever back to the original position and it's been fine. <coughs> so, back to the review on the bike. Say hello to all the other vloggers out there. We made it on to the X Wall of Fame. Uh, so, some of the negatives that have happened with the bike is down underneath here, there is a cable that wasn't attached properly and this actually came off and burnt to the exhaust pipe um, so if you own an X make sure that you have a look underneath here and uh, do some little cable ties just to be certain that it's not going to happen to you because I don't think it's under warranty at all for something like that um, other thing that's happened, which I'm not very happy about, do the seat, and actually underneath here, I've found damage to the tank. It's actually worse again than last time. So I've actually put a little bit of sticky tape over the section. So you see down here, it's actually chipped away the paint. Have a look here. There is chip marks from the seat cover. I don't know if that's just me um, being a little too enthused and jumping on the bike too heavily and too hard. I'm not a small bloke, so I've just put masking tape over it. It's just to stop if I'm gonna do any more damage to it, just to uh, make sure. As you can tell, like even that spot with the tape there has been damaged from the seat. So it has something to do with the the plastic bits underneath the seat here that do the damage. Um, never had to use the tool kit, still don't know what's in it. First aid kit, just to make sure uh, if anyone's in been injured, to jump that off. Um, as you can tell, not a, not a lot of room underneath the seat. that easy to put the seat back on <coughs> things I've learned about motorcycles since uh, riding the X as well is look after your chain now I wasn't aware that you should look after your chain as much as <laughs> you know I haven't been doing it I've been doing it probably like once a month um, lubing the chain and it's fucked my chain because I haven't done it enough. Now I travel a lot as you can tell I've done 30,000 kilometers. I only purchased this bike nine months ago. Uh, I've changed the back tire. Uh, front tire needs to be done and also my chain. My chain's on its last legs. It's nice and lube but you can tell that is bad and uh, I'm already in the red to where it's meant to be in the back here. But we're saying that new chain will be on order, next pay. Um, so I learned that you should 
be oiling your chain once a week if not twice if it's raining if it's raining you should lube it straight after you stop let it dry and then lube it if you're coming home and um, your bike's nice and hot and it hasn't been raining lube your chain when it's hot because when it's hot it seeps into your chain properly and it will stop the stretching and tears on your chain <coughs> So that's my helpful little advice that I can give you from owning a bike uh, of this caliber. And I definitely say caliber. It's a sexy little bike. So I might just uh, cut the, like the, the review. Um, if you want to see this bike doing um, what it's done, me getting angry at people on their phones, um, just meetups in general of vloggers from Australia. Um, just log into my channel, have a view. If you like it, subscribe. There's still plenty more to come. I've got plenty more videos I've got to upload, but I thought this is probably more important to get the 30,000 review out of the way to show you how good this bike really is and how much it's done. So, who's saying that? I should probably actually show you the kilometers on the bike. So there you go, just over 30,000 now and at six o'clock at night so with that have a good night and i'll see you all later jack the mice out